why? Are we having fun yet? Okay, so I don't really... Uh, I, my brain is broken. I don't understand where the Spurs are coming from with this decision. But before we talk about that, okay? Once again, I got to do this. And I know people that are already Patreon YouTube members are going to say, Oh my God, Clan, I don't want to talk about this. Can you shut up? But let's talk about it for one minute. Okay, so I will be giving away this jersey once again dejounte murray city edition jersey that was sent to me by a patron in which he said you can either keep it or you can give it away i am electing to give this beautiful thing away and all you have to do if you want to you know be entering the giveaway is just be a patron or youtube member so um i just see it as if you guys are supporting the channel every month i'm gonna give back and support you guys because i got i got you man but yeah all you have to do is just become a patreon member or youtube member um to become a patreon member link in the description for that it's only two dollars per month um right now we're around 30 so yeah so you guys just you know if, if you become a patreon member you're going to be entered and it's only two dollars okay two dollars a month i'm not trying to like break the bank from you guys or anything like if you if you want to support and you're giving it from the goodness of your heart or you just want like a giveaway item it, whatever like if you're supporting the channel i want to give back also if you want to become a youtube member people are having trouble with this but yeah it's just the join icon right here like you click that and yeah you should be able to do it through here and it's also only two dollars per month so i don't know what's going on there but um yeah you should be able to do it from a desktop but i do this every month okay and i'm gonna have the more patrons i have the more youtube members i have i'll be able to give you guys even bigger prizes maybe even than this jersey so you guys keep supporting and i'm gonna support you but this is what i want to talk about so this was in my discord uh thanks to the discord for dropping this but yeah you guys dropped this for you know content suggestions so if you want to join the discord group chat just do that link in the description for that also and yeah i don't get this so coach pop says the Despite Forbes being moved, the plan is to keep Josh Primo in Austin to get more experience there. Guys, I, I've i been fully on the train of playing in Austin. Like, like, no doubt, okay? No doubt about it. I've been full support of this. It's not like Forbes is getting a plethora of minutes in which Josh Primo will get a plethora of minutes. I understand that. And I know you're still evaluating uh, Lonnie Walker and trying to see where he fits and all this. I, I I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this because we're not winning, okay? And I know the Spurs know that we're not going to be winning. They know that we're going to get a pretty good draft pick coming up. Josh Primo isn't going anywhere, and I know that with the Austin Spurs, he'll be able to take on more of a dominating role. So I, it's not that I can't necessarily conceptualize where they're trying to go with this but i will be completely honest in saying i don't agree with this at this point like my main thing was near the half mark of the season that josh primo would be able to be that guy and be able to play in the nba and he would play his way out of the g league i'm not saying he necessarily earned that yet but this in particular i don't i don't agree with it they're literally breaking my brain right now i don't get it because in my opinion josh primo game after game he's made mistakes but he is learning being in the league like the g league he's definitely going to be able to take on a more dominating role and grow and even physically he's going to have to grow but i would say that he's getting a lot out of being in the nba right now um so in this situation i'll be honest in saying this is one of those that i just can't necessarily 100 percent support I know, and I've been the guy, like I've been on the train of, yes, yes, G League, G League, G League, G League, but this is not one of those situations because Josh, in my opinion, I feel like he's been getting a lot out of being the NBA just from what we've been seeing. And even he said himself that the G League has helped him tremendously. And it just seemed like it was kind of time for that next step because the Spurs aren't really doing anything. Even with full health, full players there, they're not doing anything. We're not going to do anything. But maybe it's just still an evaluation process, man. Maybe it's still just trying to figure out what we got and what we're going to do with it. And like I said, he's not going anywhere. It's not like going to Austin is going to necessarily just hinder him or hurt him 100%. But I just don't get this one much at all. I, I, I feel like him, the games I've seen him in the NBA, he's been making mistakes, you know, rookie mistakes. But at the same time, I've... I, I like the bonds that he's creating like with the Spurs right now but look 
anything anything is possible i understand that the spurs are all over the place right now um as far as the decision that they're making and we don't know what direction they're about to go in with the franchise um but yeah i don't know i i feel like not only do i feel like this is one where i'm scratching my head and i'm a huge optimist when it comes to the spurs but if i'm scratching my head i feel like most spurs fans are probably like why and and i i i wouldn't have an answer for you but anyways guys leave leave a comment bro like tell me what you think because i i don't get this one and my brain is just breaking trying to think of it or trying to rationalize why i don't know i i mean i don't know i have a why but i don't think it's a strong enough why to do this so you guys let me know what you think um as always like i always said or i keep saying excuse me um yeah if you want to support the channel um, you guys give back to me, I'll give back to you. All right. That's just, that's how this works. Okay. This is how it's how it's not a one way track. All right. You, you do your part. I do my part. That's just, that's just what we do around here. All right. I'll get with you guys later, man. Until next time. This is.